Hello friends. Now we will see about maintaining the computer systems. Maintaining the computer systems are very much essential because so if we don't maintain the systems well, we will be uh, facing problems like virus attacks, worm attacks, or loss of data. Number one, backup. It is very important thing to get the habit of backing up your files on a regular basis. This means having a recent copy of important data held onto your computer. The important documents on your system include the invoices, legal documents, or personal files such as photo albums. You can copy your files to a USB memory stick. Uh, USB memory sticks do not have enough data to store, so preferably you can buy a hard disk to store your data. Number 2. Deleting Files Storing huge data and big files on your computer can bring performance speeds immediately down. In order to make sure a computer is running efficiently, it's important to delete unnecessary files from time to time. So Windows operating system is a disk cleanup function that is extremely quick and easy to use. Number 3. Scanning your hard drive It is really important to scan your hard drive as another routine task, which you should get into the habit of doing regularly. This utility examines the hard drive for some errors that could have a direct effect on your computer's efficiency. This needs to be done around once a week to use your computers every day or once in a month in case if you use less frequently. Number 4. Defragmenting your hard drive The computer's hard drive can become clogged up with numerous files that are broken up across various locations around the drive. Defragmentation collects all the different parts of one file back together in one place in the hard drive. Number 5. Clearing your cache files this folder of cache is temporary internet files folder and is a record of files which have been viewed or downloaded from the web including web pages, images, music, cookies, temporary videos, etc. This creates on your computer to help them deliver personalized content when you next visit the sites. So you can often clear these cached files to get more memory on your browser, to get more memory on your system, to speed up things. Number 6. Automatic Updating Computer hackers are determined to destabilize computer software through their malicious programs. The recent example you know well, ransomware. Ransomware hackers used the bug in Windows XP to get used millions of users' computers attacked. So, updating your voice to the latest version is always important. If you run on Windows, then make sure your computer is set to update automatically. Number 7. Checking for Viruses Installing some form of antivirus software is a must. The computer is vulnerable to a range of viruses. These viruses are transmitted to a computer via infected email attachments. These viruses are called worms and can spread over the internet. So Gmail has introduced so many checkpoints to avoid these viruses but still people are spreading these viruses through other email systems and all. Number 8. Installing Anti-Malware, Spyware and Adware Malware, Spyware and Adware all pose a significant threat to your online privacy and the smooth running of your computer. It is extremely essential to install along with antivirus software. The anti-spyware software also is important. Number 9. Setting up your firewall Firewalls are a significant way of protecting your computer from some of the threats that have crept up in the cyberspace world. Firewalls are an effective way to safeguard from your hackers, viruses and worms. What a firewall will do is, it will create a virtual wall where you can uh, block internet access to some of your applications. Some of the applications you think are vulnerable, you can block internet access to those applications. Number 10. Cleaning your computer Ensuring that your computer is clean of dust and dirt can make sure the computer is kept under hygienic conditions. Make sure the computer is turned off and unplugged before you clean it. Ok friends, thank you for watching this session on exam bin. I will see you again in the next session where we will be seeing about some different topic from computer awareness series. Till then, goodbye.